welcome back to the NASCAR Inside Line Let's Play. Ladies and gentlemen, right now I'm about to do race 6 at 36. I'm here at Martinsville Speedway here in Martinsville, Virginia for the running of the Good Fast Relief, Goodies Fast Relief 500. And, uh, yeah, um, not going to do very good here because I normally don't do good at Martinsville on these uh, newer Martis, uh, NASCAR games and stuff like that. Or the past NASCAR games like a few years back. Uh, let's just see what happens here. Uh, finished ninth at Auto Club Speedway. Surprisingly, I finished ninth there because I uh, really thought I had a good shot of uh, having a win there, but my car was just so tight throughout the whole race, and I was in that. So anyway, uh, champion difficulty, uh, 50 laps, tire wear a few use times to one, cautious of black flags on, full damage on, and let's accept the changes. And uh, just gonna skip to qualifying. And go for two laps here. See which bad finish, uh, bad starting spot I get. So let's see what happens here. So let's just get right on to it. And here we go. Qualifying is on the way here at Martinsville Speedway. Jimmy Johnson has the pole so far with a 19.28. No surprise that Johnson's up here at Martinsville. Oh my god, 43rd, really? Holy crap, oh my god, I'm... Well, I guess I might start in last. Look at that, now I'm going into the red. Holy cow. And I rarely qualify last, so this is uh, one of those new occurrences, rare occurrences, I should say. Man, 43rd. It just makes Jeff Gordon look bad here in Martinsville somehow. I mean, Jeff Gordon has nine total wins here. So it just makes it look bad, you know what I mean? Alright, so what a great start to this race is qualified last. What can I say? I'm terrible here at Martinsville. And I honestly rarely qualify last at Martinsville, you know? So here we are at Martinsville Speedway here in Martinsville, Virginia for the Goodies Fast Relief 500. <clears throat> so, yep. This should be fun. Let's see how many positions I can make up. Or will I suck? We'll find out. So Jimmy Johnson starts on the pole. Carl Edwards starts second. Uh, all right, I guess he does. You know what? I yeah, that's always messed up. So Johnson's on the pole Kyle Busch second uh, Carl Edwards third and Brad Keselowski fourth There's the goodies fast relief 500 words trophy if you win here on Mars for Speedway Something I would not get so I would definitely fall outside the top 10 points here So the pace cars off Jimmy Johnson and Kyle Busch will lead us down to the green flag as we're set to go for 50 laps here at the paperclip green flies in the air We are underway here at Martinsville Speedway Jimmy Johnson leads the first lap. And boy, I'm making up positions because they're stacking up up here. I'm, wow, I got the fastest lap at Martinsville. That won't last long, though. Someone will beat me for that fast lap right here. Boy, I've already moved up 12 spots. Oh, come on. I had fast lap going. It wasn't going to be the fastest lap of the race, but I had a fast lap going. Oh gosh. Boy, are they still slowing up up here? I've moved up 15 spots already, guys. At Martinsville. This is crazy. Oh. Uh, so you know that this game is broken when I moved up 15 spots in a... At at a Martinsville race. You know something's wrong. <laughs> Looks like Jimmy Johnson is pulling away. Look at this. And guys, you... 
I have proof this is on champion difficulty, too. You know? You saw me accept the changes with champion difficulty. And this is just crazy already. I moved up 20 spots already? Okay, stop coming down. You idiots! Stop that! I had- uh, on, He put me down the curb! I had a- I was underneath him and then he, st he was coming down, coming down, coming down. And I was on the curb and all of a sudden I went up into him because I was on the curb. So I still put blame on him for that. Oh, wow. Alright, now this is where I'm going to suck, yep. And the Patrick tried to get around me. Oh my god, car, can you please turn? You were doing so well in the first few laps, let's keep that up. I set my new fast slap. Alright, don't come. Don't. Mmm. Hornish. Golly. God, oh my god. And then you had to check up there for whatever reason, did you? Goodness gracious. Game. Man, I'm so glad Dudes and Mary Martin Racing is making these NASCAR games now. She Technics would just. Oh. Oh, golly. I thought I was going to get turned there by Hornish. Maybe he's mad because I ran the back of him. Well, maybe if he wouldn't slow down coming off the corner, maybe I would not. See if I can at least finish in the top 20. Jimmy Johnson's not pulling away by far. Whoever's running second is uh, sticking with him. Oh my god, car. Turn! This is ridiculous. Jeez, I did so. Ten laps complete here. I'm marked supposed to be way as Jimmy Johnson is the race leader. And I'm running in 23rd. Oh my god, Joseph. Nice job, buddy. Not really. Oh my god. What is wrong with this car all of a sudden? It's not performing like it was in the first few laps of the race. Am I getting another tight race car like I did at Auto Club Speedway? Good gosh, man. This car will either be loose or tight in any of the races. Like Daytona, the car was loose. At Phoenix, the car was tight. At Las Vegas, the car was loose. Bristol, it was kind of okay, though. And then Auto Club, it was tight. So it doesn't matter, you know? Oh my god, every t- mm. Oh, okay, Hornish, hi. Get out of here. Oh my god, really? You're gonna dive bomb me like that? Why would you like if I did this? Never mind. <laughs> oh, I hate Martinsville. I, I like it in real life, don't get me wrong, but I don't like racing here. So I'm back to 24th. Makes Jeff Gordon look bad here, you know what I mean? Can't turn the car whatsoever. Mmm. God, I have to break so early just to make the corner. However, I do get back on the gas early, so I do like that. So yeah, I get on the brakes early to make the corner, but I do get back on the gas uh, sooner, so... So Jimmy Johnson has the fast lap of the race so far, and he's the race leader, 20:53. Wow, I got sideways there. 
Gosh darn it, car, really? Alright, the cars ahead of me are pulling away from me, but I'm pulling away from the drivers behind me, so... Good God, car! I hit the curb just a little bit. <sighs> I can't wait for this race to be over, all right? 30 laps to go at Martinsville. Jimmy Johnson is the race leader. Oh my god, Joseph. A little bit too early on the turning left. Good gosh, man. I can never get Martinsville down, unless maybe if I make a setup for once. I mean, I do pretty good with default setup overall, but... Hmm. Oh, fight. Uh... I don't think I'm holding these guys up behind me. I wonder if it's just... The cars ahead of me are just that fast, and yet they're just slow behind me. Looks like Jimmy Johnson's hit some lap traffic. I don't want to finish a lap down. I've never really got into some big situations in this race so far. It's been kind of clean. There's a couple of times where uh made some contact with some drivers, you know. But other than that, it's been kind of clean. See how I have to break so early going in the corner just to make the corner. I, like I said, I do get back on the gas early, which is helping me stay ahead of the guys behind me, like Danica Patrick, David Stremme, and uh, Eric Almarola. So at the halfway point here at Martinsville Speedway, Jimmy Johnson, the race leader, set the fast lap of the race with a 20.53, and I'm running back in 24th. My fast lap is a 20.95. So four tenths off of his fast lap time, which isn't bad for me considering it's at Martinsville, but, uh, you know... Not a bad race for me so far. I mean, oh wow, as I say that, wow, I really overdrove the corner. I even braked early too. What was that all about, game? Smooth through here. I think I'm holding up the traffic behind me, you know? That's how slow I'm going. I mean, Hornish has pulled away from me by five seconds now. Turn. Twenty laps to go for Jimmy Johnson, the race leader. I'm running back in 24th still. Can Jimmy Johnson become the, th the fourth driver in this Let's Play to lead every lap and win the race? Matt Kenseth did it at Phoenix. Montrex Jr. at Las Vegas. And Greg Biffle at Auto Club Speedway. They all led every lap and won the race. So, Jimmy Johnson is trying to become the fourth different driver. However, when Greg Biffle won at All Club Speedway, he started fourth in that race and he immediately got up to the front on the first lap and led the first lap and then led every lap from then on. It's like I'm pulling away from Danica and the rest of the field behind me more than what I have been. 
get that early exit speed, you know what I mean? Which is really helping. Alright, so on the possum, though, I'll at least finish on the lead lap if, it, if I don't run into any trouble, so, uh, you know. I don't get myself into trouble. <laughs> That'd be a positive note, you know what I mean? Oh, my nose, I just think I have a straightaway. Oh, so, oh god, I just yanked one of my earbuds out. Good gosh. Now I can only hear the engine on one side. Hold on. Oh, I tried to grab the earbud and I slipped it. I grabbed it and then slipped out my hand again. Oh my gosh. Uh, hold on, straight away. Oh god, yes. That's even better. Now I can hear the engine on both ears. I'm so happy. <laughs> oh goodness, something's wrong with me, guys. Now, because of that, these guys behind me caught me because I was more focused on trying to get my earbud in my left ear. <laughs> I said I really haven't ran into some big troubles in this race. So honestly, it's kind of unusual for me at uh, Martinsville. I mean, what? I moved up. Oh, God. I moved up 20 spots at the beginning of the race, like in the first few laps. Also, it's been stabilized. And I believe that was the first time I hit the wall as well. So that wasn't bad. I hit the wall down coming off turn number two, previous lap. It doesn't look like Hornish and the others ahead of me are pulling away anymore. It was, it's been 5.2, 5.3, about five and a half seconds they're ahead of me the past few laps. As Jimmy Johnson will lead with 10 laps to go here at Martinsville Speedway. He is the race leader as I'm running back in 24th. No surprise to see Jimmy Johnson run well at Martinsville. He's led every lap in this race so far. Can he lead the final 10 laps? He's also set the fast lap of the race with the 20.53. Oh my... What in the world happened there? Did the... I mean, I did no, nothing different than what I've been doing every other lap, and the car just did not want to turn there at all? Now, see, look. Now, that's a Martisville-looking car. With all the scratches and stuff. And that makes more sense, you know? Eight laps to go. Hmm. So it looks like if I could stay consistent right now, it looks like I'll finish 24th in this race. Which is not bad, considering I qualified last for this race, you know what I mean? I thought I was going to have that issue today in this race where no way I'm going to be passing a lot of cars, but I did. Passed 19 cars since the drop of the green flag. Oh, I messed up the entry just a little bit. Come on, car, turn. Come on, car, turn. Five laps to go for Jimmy Johnson. You know, it's rare that Jeff Gordon finishes like outside the top 20 at Martinsville. I know he's finished outside the t top 20 in Marksville in real life before, but it just makes it look weird. Just making Jeff Gordon look bad here, you know what I mean? With his nine wins. 
Three laps to go for Johnson. It's been caution free race this whole entire race, so. And two laps to go now. You know, I've noticed in the past few laps, I've uh, been catching uh, Hornish and stuff like that in the rest of the field. But no way I'm going to catch him, don't get me wrong, but I mean, I've noticed that. And coming up, up to the white flag. White flag is out. Final lap for Jimmy Johnson here in Montesville. So I'm coming around for the white flag now. Down the back straightaway for the final time for Johnson. As I have taken the white flag. In the turns number three or four. And then out turn number four. Jimmy Johnson will win the goodies fast relief 500 here at Marchesville Speedway. As I'm down the back straightaway for the final time. Going into turn number three. And now coming off turn number four. It looks like I am going to finish 24th here at Marchesville today. Ah. Uh, you know, I mean, I moved up 19 positions, so considering I qualified last, that's not bad, honestly. So let's look at the race results here. So, hold on. Yeah, here we go. So Jimmy Johnson wins here at, at Martinsville Speedway. Carl Edwards second, Kyle Busch third. Brad Keselowski fourth, Kevin Harvick fifth, Tony Stewart sixth, Dale Knight Jr. seventh. Juan Pablo Montoya finishes 8th, Casey K 9th, and Martin Truex Jr. rounds out the top 10. Jimmy Johnson set the fast lap of the race with the 2053 and led every lap in this race. He's so four, the four out of the first six races, driver that's led every lap won the race. That's crazy, you know. That's kind of crazy to me. So Ryan Newman 11th, Matt Kenseth 12th, Denny Hamlin 15th. Kurt Busch 16th, Clint Boyer 17th, Joey Legao 18th, Greg Biffle 19th, and Mark Martin rounds up the top 20. 21st, Jamie McMurray. 24th is me and Jeff Gordon, slash Jeff Gordon. 25th, Danica Patrick. And rounding up the top 30 is Marcus Ambrose. 31st is David Reagan. 35th is Dave Blaney. And rounding up the top 40 is Robbie Gordon. 41st is Joe Nemechek. 42nd, Josh Weiss. The finishing 43rd and last place is Travis Quapel. So let's just get out of this racetrack. I'm so glad I don't have to race here for a while. I think next race is Texas. I think they had Texas in the seventh race of the season. Maybe. I hope so. I hope I'm right. You know? <laughs> so. 24th at Martinsville today. Not good. But it's not bad considering I qualified last and moved up the field, the field some. So let's look at the point things. Obviously, I believe I fell outside the top 10 points. Oh, yeah, definitely. Okay. So, Jimmy Johnson is a new points leader. Actually, Jimmy Johnson and Carl Edwards are tied for the points lead. Danny Hamlin is third in points, six points back. Martin Truex Jr. fourth in points, 15 back. And Matt Kenson rounds up the top five points, 205 points back. Uh, not 205 points back, 16 points back. My goodness, Joseph. And Jamie McMurray rounds up the top 10 points, 192 back. And Juan Pablo Montoya right now has the last transfer spot, but still plenty of races left. You know, we have 20 races before the chase starts. And I have fallen outside the top 10 in points. I am now 15th in points. Um, uh, 46 points back. This looks like Jeff Gordon's season in 2012, honestly. In actual 2012. It's all right, I got some good tracks coming up, so I could definitely move myself back in the top 10. I am 17 points back outside the top 10, but I have to be in the top 12 to make the chase. So next race is going to be at, uh, let me make sure it's Texas Motor Speedway. Yes, it is. Next race is at Texas Motor Speedway, and uh, I will see you at the Lone Star State.